Hey guys, I'm back with another print and cut card that holds those little glass bottles. This time I'm doing one for teachers. This one will hold like flower seeds in it, just like the Mother's Day card. So right now I'm just inserting the design. I chose to insert one that we personalize so I can help you with how to do that. So I'm inserting one design and then the coordinating backing for that design. Now that they're in our workspace, I'm gonna resize each one to four by five inches. Now you can add in your text for your teacher's name. You can use whatever font you wanna do, and I think white shows up the best, so you wanna change your font color to white and then weld your design. After you center your name, you want to select your added text plus your card and then flatten it together. I'm just aligning my cards right now and then I'm going to rotate them and attach it and then click on make it. And we're going to now send to our printer and like always, we are going to choose the Use System dialog box. Make sure your Add Bleed is on here, so that way it prints in where the white is, so you don't have like any like white um, outlines around your cut marks. You want to change your settings to the best quality and to matte paper if you're using matte cardstock. And then today, I'm actually testing a brand new Light Grip matte that I got from Timu. So right now I'm just opening that up and it actually worked really well. It was just like a Cricut mat, nothing, you know, extraordinary, but it definitely worked well and it was a really good price. So I will be ordering more of these in the future. Now you just add your cardstock onto your mat and load it into your machine. I'm just cutting this on the cardstock setting that's on the dial. And then your machine will start scanning the black printed corners. And I will speed through this so that you don't have to watch this because it does take a little while to do this. Especially because this is a brand new mat, so it's extra sticky. You want to turn your mat over and bend it to try to get your pieces to not roll up. Um, with these, at least it's, we're going to be gluing the top down to the bottom, so it will straighten out a little bit if you have this issue.
To glue the top piece down, I normally just use a regular school glue stick. You can also use tacky glue for this. So for these, these are just like the Mother's Day cards that I did. So you can just pick up some flower seeds and add them to your bottles. And then what I did with these, I um, just took some tape and I taped the bag of the seeds on the back so that they knew what was in front and then how to take care of them. If you have any questions feel free to leave them in the comments and i'll do my best to help you out thank you so much for watching see you next time bye